have in front of me an Edition 4 megapixel hybrid CCTV camera. It covers 960H, um, AHD, CDI, TDI, uh, and it also has an integrated uh, satellite uh, finder and terrestrial meter. It's a super piece of kit. It's available with free delivery from freetv.ie. Definitely the best satellite meter I've come across. And the fact that it's at a great price point and will do the satellite and terrestrial, huge bonus for anybody who's in that sort of space that we, we cater for here at freetv.ie. So what do you get and how does it work? Well, I'm going to jump right in and say, this is the outer box that comes in. Inside of this, we have this inner box here for transporting your meter around safely. It has a user manual inside and pouches for all the accessories, okay? Move that out of the way quickly. Inside of that is this unit here, which you'd always come along and uh, have inside the case. I'm just going to take it out here for demonstration purposes. Um, I'll come back to actually this in a second. And what we'll say here is, I'll just hit the on switch here and have this turning on in the background. Um, what we have here is we have charger uh, for charging the car. We have a, a, a 3.5 to AVE output lead here. We use this lead here if we had to force RS-232 um, onto it there. And that's really for software upgrade if you really screw it up, but probably not possible to do so. But anyway, that, that's how we recover it here. People generally have special PCs for using that format. Um, what we have here then is we just have a strap for transporting it here. Um, just to say here that the units here have lovely little handles on the side. There's a clips here if you want to put things over, but secure, lightweight. You have the power unit here with a three pin plug with a remote control that we could use with it. And then we have these two very handy cables one for powering cameras and one for taking the picture from your camera back. Now, it doesn't support IP cameras, which would be cool if it did. But um, we've been working with Edition for quite some time in relation to hoping they'll bring this product into the market because we've assured them we'll buy loads of them because we're going to sell them out to them because there's nothing else on the market like it. Uh, what I'm going to do at this point is I'm going to um, shove this power lead in here and I'm going to unfurl it here. And what I might actually do is I'll just go directly into the menu thing here and show where we're going to be looking at the cameras and where that's all going to happen. Actually, we'll point over to this box with a nice backdrop for our camera. So the camera I'm using here is a one megapixel and it's hybrid, so it can be set up in a number of technologies. I'm going to use that to demonstrate things here. What I'm going to do at this point is I'm going to hit the menu button, which is here, and I'm going to come down as far as CCTV, which is here. And we're going to see two menu choices inside of it. We have um, the four eight. Uh, we have the ability, we'll say, for um, the power. Um, a camera or with the ability to control and um, set up a PTZ here. Okay, what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to tilt this forward very quickly and say along the top, what we have here is we have a USB port here we can use to extract recordings, change software. This port here is used for powering cameras. It's a 12 volt uh, one amp output on it. We have a BNC in, a BNC out, a HDMI in, a HDMI, in, a HDMI out. Um, the significant thing is that is we can actually use this just as a TV screen basically um, if we're taking an external thing on it. Um, we have the RS-232 port here uh, and the AV out as well. And what we have here at this point is we have the RS-485 for the PTZ control. We have an Ethernet connector, our satellite um, input here if we're using a satellite meter or as a digital terrestrial meter here. We have a CA card slot if we had encrypted channels on the satellite side of it. And then what we have is um, the power unit here for the power and charge it. And then finally on the back, what we have is the power on off switch here. Okay, little speakers on the side as well. So what I'm going to do at this point is I am just going to say we want to look at a satellite um, or at our actual camera. And I'm going to just grab this camera here. Um, I just need, need to grab the lead. So the BNC lead here, run it over the top and then we'll just put it into the video in. So here we have our input. Initially, it doesn't know what it is, okay? And then it comes along and it says, oh, I know what it is, it's TDI and it's 720, so it's one megapixel, okay? So all of a sudden then, and this is why we're using the hybrids on it, we're just gonna use this here come along and change it to a different technology and suddenly it doesn't know what it is and then it's saying hang on what is this and the next thing it clicks up on the screen and tells us uh, that it's AHD it's one megapixel again so it knows what it is so not alone can we view the camera it'll actually tell us what the technology is so
So if you think of the scope of this, like where we are, I'm talking here now in March of 2018, you know, we have some 4 megapixel in IP, but generally for all the hybrid stuff, vast majority of stuff being civil as 2 megapixel and um, things like this. So it's really future proof in itself, the fa fact that it can handle 4 megapixel. The super can do that, and the fact then that we can actually go set up and control the PTZ from it here as well using this connection on the top. That's a big advantage as well, okay? Just to quickly give an overview of the other features that are on it, I'm just going to hit exit out here and exit out here. We'll go back to the main menu. So what we have here is, if we just go back to the top part here, we have the find here, and we went in here, we come along and we could do a search here for um, the satellite and for the terrestrial inside of that, okay? And we can display the channels, all the rest, we set it up for our local things, which is the best satellite for us. Um, what we could do here is there's a spectrum analyzer on it. If we had TV channels programmed in, we could display it here. Uh, if we come along here, we have, um, that's a media thing. So if we actually went in there, we could actually play back AVI files and have this as a sort of portable um, back of the car media player, okay? Um, if we come down here, we have things like YouTube and all the rest of it uh, inside of it there, if we set it up on the web. Um, if we come along here, system settings, we can change things there. And then eventually at the very bottom here, it's just the auto visual part of it. So overall, it's super. I could, I could go on for hours uh, waxing lyrical on it, but you will not find a better meter at the price range in this. This is super. This deserves a huge pat on the back because they have gone and made something absolutely wonderful here.